Hi everybody, welcome back to Carly Style. Today is a special, special, super special episode. We're on the Mom's View. Hi! What? I mean, Mom's View set, oh. not the Mom's View. I'm like, view. no, you tricked me. I didn't agree to the Mom's View <laughs> shoot. I said I'll do a shoot for you. Yeah, no, he doesn't like the Mom's. So I have all my brothers here today. Logan's in town, he's doing a J. Biebs video. Mm -hmm. Check it out. <laughs> and I thought we would have some brother and sister time. So glad you guys are here. Give me a <laughs> Get over here, act like you love us. Okay, so we one thing I wanted to address was memories with Logan because I feel like Logan's a bit younger than you guys, and you guys are out of the house. Me and Logan have more memories together yeah, than you guys kind of do. True. But the fans want to know what are your <coughs> memories? Some of your best memories you have with Logan, or if you have any. I'm still waiting. That were even okay. Working on them, you know. <laughs> yeah. I was thinking about that this morning about uh, when Logan was born. Oh yeah. Oh, somebody a fan did ask where were we at the where day? Where were you at? Do you, Do you remember, remember the day he was born? I can remember I know where actually. You were at. Mom went into labor and uh, it was right before school, and you wanted to go to the hospital, and I said I didn't want to. I'd go to school. So I don't I, think that's what happened. <laughs> yes, it is. Casey has a or, no, you got, we got called out of school. Yeah, we yeah. got called out of school. And I was like, no, I'll stay at school. And I was like, yeah, I want to go. I hate home. hospitals. So, so I was like, no, I, I want to go. I went to the, did I go to hospital yeah. and you stayed at school? Yeah. She, because I remember I was in uh, eighth grade? Ninth grade. I was in ninth grade. Yeah, I was 15 when, when she had him. And I was in ninth grade. And uh, I remember I was in seminary. I was in like the church class. It's like a separate building. And it's like there's a phone in there. And so mom was in the hospital. And she called me. And she's like, I'm in the hospital. I'm in labor. And I'm like, <laughs> I want to come. <laughs> so I'm 15. I think I had my driver's license. I yeah, had probably. just barely, barely That's got awesome. my driver's That's license. Me. I had this little 1980 Toyota Tercel, so. this yellow car that I called Herbie. My grandpa, <laughs> Eugene, bought it the day I was born. And then when I turned 15, I got my driver's license. He gave it to me. That's another story we'll tell you later. Anyways, <laughs> so there I was on the phone. My mom was having him. And it was, it was, was it a, were you a mistake? Was it, no. was it on purpose? I, no, I begged sure mom purpose. and dad for one. Because you guys are out of the house. I was like all yeah. alone. I'm like, please have a brother or sister for me. And mom, I guess mom went on their honeymoon. Or they went on it. No, just JK. What? No, they got married. And they went on their honeymoon. Did they did an Carly talked mom and dad into having another kid. Yeah. No, <laughs> so Carly booked mom and dad a flight to listen, Jamaica. Listen, and that's how Logan happened. I hate that. Might have asked them to come here today. Listen. I asked mom and dad to have a brother or sister because I wanted one. And mm. so for their anniversary, I went to grandma's house, you know. Do and you, mom, I, are you sure and mom, I, I don't I, care. Mom told me to tell the story. She told dad, she said, you have one shot. Nuh-uh. <laughs> she told me that story. Are you serious? It was That's when terrible. we had that terrible. Is she okay with you telling this story? Laurie, you tell lots of my stories, so I'm telling you her story. <laughs> Wow, this is getting she weird. You were that one shot, bro. One, one in a million. Shot. So That's you're telling me there's a chance. One shot kill. That's Good job, Dad. <laughs> it's appropriate. <laughs> He's got swimmers. Only one, though. That's <laughs> terrible. <laughs> Anyways. So Logan was really meant to be. And I remember remember that Oh, that van. The green. Right. Huge. It was like a 15-passenger van. The 12-passenger yeah, Mormon, Mormon attack built vehicle. Assault vehicle. We only have four kids. Why did mom and dad want that van? I don't know. It was fun to drive, though. I remember. Why did you bring up that van? Uh, because I remember that when they told me we were on our way home from Tremont and in that van, and mom pulls over on the side of the road in this huge van, and we're sitting there, and she's like, I have something to tell you. Oh, that she was pregnant? I don't yeah. remember that. That's I funny. don't remember that either. It's, and it's funny <laughs> that when I think back there, and so knowing like... being a woman, I'm like, she couldn't have known she was pregnant when she picked me up from grandma's on the way home. But that's how my mind is connecting this. Oh, yeah. But it was had to be some other time. But I remember she pulled how over on the you? freeway. You were young. Yeah, you were like eight. I was eight, eight, seven. So maybe I'm seven. So like Suntard's age when they had him. Yeah, okay, interesting. Yeah, I was 15 because I remember mom. There was this little thing that mom had. This is what I, this little memory, weird memory that I had. Mom had this little, like, like, craft or some crap that was on the wall <laughs> and it was like family and it had like these four little like these hooks on it, like these little rabbits and she made this like at, at relief society or whatever and she's like and it had like four and there was only three of us at the time and she's like i took that as a sign that we needed to have one more or something like that and that, that was because of me and that, yeah that was i guess that was, yeah. <laughs> yeah. how cool. do you feel about being the fourth what was your experience where were you in the day you were born I was in the hospital. He's in Idaho. I was in Idaho. You were born. You're the only one born in Idaho. Yeah, you guys are all born and out of. Do state. you remember when you were born? That you, uh, you probably don't remember this, no. but you had to wear those. Oh, uh, right. I don't remember that. Those braces. The I braces saw a picture. on your legs. He had hip dysplasia. Yeah. They when he. I guess it's like one out of. I don't know. 
whatever. I don't it's just, know. It's not, it's not like it's are. But he, yeah, he had like this, they called it hip dysplasia. Look it, it up just, on the freaking yeah. internet, whatever it is. Because and he had to wear this brace. You had to wear this like brace that all these vel Velcro things on it. And when yeah. we changed your diaper, I remember changing your diaper, you'd be like, because <laughs> those the brace would like restrict your legs, and so we'd be changing your diaper, and you'd be like stretching like your legs. You'd be like this. <laughs> you'd be like, ah, just bend the leg, and you could never bend it. It was like I remember, and we would always be like, "That's so cute. He wants to stretch his legs." And mom was always like, "Take that brace off it. He doesn't yeah. need that." And I, she was always pissed because like the doctors came in and she acted like it was the doctor's fault that you had hip dysplasia. Really? She's like, "Well, they don't know." And something. I'm like, "Mom, just like wear the freaking make him wear the brace." And he's like, "He doesn't need it." Yeah. Anyway, I don't remember that at all. I don't yeah, you were a tiny baby. Yeah. So you. What's your remember. earliest memory of these two? These two. Yeah. I don't know. It's. Remember us changing your diaper? No. And you're going like this? I don't remember that. <laughs> like that? You don't remember that? What did you eat this morning? <laughs> Holy cow. My shorts are riding up, I feel like. Be reverent. Fold your arms. It's going to be okay. Anyways. No, I just, I remember the biggest memory I have of you guys is that red car you guys used to just drive around. That little Mazda. Oh, the 323? Three, three? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because you yeah. had that too. Mm -hmm. He had a blue one. You had a red one. I see, I don't remember that. I just remember the red one. We had that car for a long time. Where did I get that I, car? Rick and Becky. Rick, oh, Becky yeah. Goodwin. I bought, we had this car that I remember my, one of some of my parents' friends had, and I remember I bought it from him for like 3,200 bucks. And I was, I was working at Sandpiper at the time, yeah. You remember when you put the rims and tires on it? And, <laughs> and they got, got stolen. stolen the next day? And they were sitting on blocks that? in the hood. No. We grew up in the I hood. I don't have that many memories like The that. hood of Pocatello. Pocatello. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so I asked some Questions fans. Questions for Logie Bear. I tweeted out that we're gonna do this and they wanted, they sent some questions. So this one comes from Tech News and they want to know, if you were all stranded on an island, what would you bring and why? Go first, Logan. Can I go last so nope. I can think about it? Hmm. Like, what do you, I, there needs to be some like yeah. ramifications. Nope. Like, yeah, I can like just bring whatever I want. It? No, you have to bring one item on an island, stranded is island. Is it a warm island? You, I mean, that's for I'd bring an airplane. <laughs> you would bring an airplane. A helicopter, helicopter. Can I change my answer? You, it's like one item, so you can't have a pilot, so you better know how to fly There's gonna, that there's, in I there. want a helicopter that comes with an, like a, an instruction one. manual. Like a manual how to That's operate That's two it. things. You can only have but one. But most helicopters uh, will one. come with an yeah. operator's <laughs> manual. That's like just I part of the helicopter package. I want one fully equipped Oh, it's helicopter. because last time you flew a helicopter, it gave you a manual. All, yeah, okay. Seriously, all I don't... <laughs> listen, manufacturers of helicopters, back me up on this. Don't they all come with an operator's manual? They because got to. Usually when you buy one, they're like, yeah, check the jockey boxes. It's going to tell you. Yeah, it's like a car. It's like a car you buy one and it's just like... There, there's got to be some sort of like, this is how you turn it on. I bring a cell phone yeah, because probably, a cell phone, you, you can do anything school. and yeah. everything. No, I bet you if you go buy a helicopter, there's like a how-to. When you guys are like at your local Target, please let us know when you buy a helicopter <laughs> what the manual says. Logan? I have no idea what I'd bring. You're going to um, die, Casey. Yeah. A cell phone. Well, oh, how do you know if you don't what have service? What if you have enough service? Yeah. I'd have then my cell phone to play games. wants to tweet stuff. I'd have my cell phone to play games. I'd bring water. I'd bring a boat. I want a boat. I want a boat. I have a boat. You Make sure the like manual. Black stuff on your ears. It's right that here. freaking glue. Glue from, come from yesterday. Yeah. Okay, you guys are not answering Sorry. this right. Okay, this question comes from Jenna Carding. She wants to know. Ask Logan if he ever wants to move to LA. Hmm. 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 Let me think about that one. Um, yeah, actually, I do want to move to LA. Um, I'd like to go to. I'm moving down here this summer. Tell them I know that, Broham. I'm moving down to LA this summer. What are your plans? Uh, to make videos with Maker Studios. Where are you gonna live at? You better get an Probably apartment. should find that out. <laughs> you better get a job in an apartment. <laughs> yeah. Who's gonna take care of you? I don't know. I was how hoping, are you really? I was hoping, how yeah. long are you gonna be here this summer? I can be here for upwards to like three months. Are you sure? Yeah. Mom said you had something though. I thought you had. I have to. Thing. I have one thing that's gonna last like a week. It's what just is a, it? It's just a football camp. When is it? Um, in July fourteenth. How many push-ups can you do? <laughs> In a row. What position or are you going to play this year? Logan corner. McKay. Dude, you need to play receiver. You I, need to be the I'm kicker. Then you're not going to get hurt. No, I'm playing corner. He, corner? Yeah, it's the exact same thing, but on defense. I cover the receivers. Is that what a corner does? Yeah. That, Logan that? got a Is really bad concussion this last year. Do I know what year. a cornerback is? Yeah, yeah. no Tell joke. That concussion, concussion ruined me. You're well, ruined. You look like you're ruined. Because your like, hair flips it. Yeah. Ruin me. Ruin my career. Ruin my hair flipping ability. Ruin my football career. <laughs> Good thing it never ruined your money maker. Video. You guys are goofballs. <laughs> but um, the concussion? Yeah. Let's 
kind tell of a long Kate story. Tell the story. I don't really remember that night, though. I need somebody else to tell it I remember mom calling I remember, like, he's freaking out. I thought Logan was dying from the phone call I got from I, mother. I thought his head was detached from his body somewhere in a mountain. I'm like, I know. what? The things mom told me, From the intensity me, though, of that phone call. All he was doing when I talked to him was crying on the phone. No, he I was. <laughs> I didn't know what was going so, on. So, okay, there was a football game, and Logan got hit really hard. And I made laid it. out, passed out on the football field. You know, no, but the thing is, the thing is, I got back up, and I don't recall this, but I played like six more plays, and my coach did not know what I was doing. Because I'd be like in the backfield. I'm supposed to be on the D-line. I'm in the backfield trying to play linebacker. So you were all like all disoriented. Yeah, I didn't know what. They'd say hut, and I'm like walking around on the field. And then fi- and they didn't call me out either. I kept playing. Because that's normal really? for you. Yeah, and then I got off the field. You're like, ah, oh, it's Logan just wandering no, around the 15-yard line again. Picking up rocks and... <laughs> just let him play. His I'm mom and dad are here. They want to see him. Skipping rocks across the field. No, Picking dandelions out there. It's an indoor stadium. You know what? Logan actually is a good athlete now. Back when he was younger, I was really worried about him. Because you were like a little chubby kid when you I were was. younger. <laughs> You were. I know I was. I, you I were a little, really you were, anything. honestly, this might sound bad, but you look just like Suntard. Exactly. Yeah. And that's why, like, I know Suntard's going to grow into this big, strong guy, because now yeah. you're, like, super, Show like, him your biceps. he's the tallest. <laughs> he's, like, got the best jeans out of all of us. He's the yeah. tallest, best We got looking. better and skinnier and better looking as he mom also and dad had the biggest, have kids. What? So I'm the third, or the second best looking. Sorry. Dude, I'm the best looking. You're the worst. Who's the best looking? Leave it in the comments below. <laughs> oh, I hope I win. Vote for me. So Logan McKay 55. we're all very humbled, too. <laughs> has a nickname, and it's called The Birdman. The Birdman. The Birdman. In case this is a terrible tell story. Us how I feel bad because I don't know this story. You were on your mission. Oh, yeah, I was gone. You were serving the Lord. You should feel really bad. I'm such a good man. So Shay was out of this story, so if you can go sit off. Okay, I'll be over here. <laughs> <laughs> no, we were, what were we doing? We were in just in. We were at Lisa's no. house at oh, a barbecue. We Okay, okay, yeah. I, this this memory. And I have, Logan like, comes bebopping. How old were you? Probably six or seven. I was like five. Five, four. So Logan comes bebopping in the house. I was with A pocket full of something, and he's hiding it from everybody. And we're all like, <laughs> Logan, what do you what do you got in your pocket? And he's like, Oh, nothing. And he goes downstairs and. No, you're telling it wrong. Dude. Okay, no. Logan. You're telling it completely wrong. Logan okay. kept playing. Logan, Logan making tell, stuff up. Tell your five year old memory version of it, and then he'll tell it when you. Okay. This I feel like all of us have good. wild imaginations. So <laughs> anytime like, we no, 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 no. So here was it's a pterodactyl right. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. Wasn't that Finish. Big hey, of a you joke. tell okay. your version. Um, we were at the barbecue and I was out in the field and I think I don't know. There was this field. bird. Yeah, it was a field, you and there was this bird. You can't reveal it right now. That's why you have to tell <laughs> you the story. No, this is this is how it happened. This is what happened. There was this bird in the field, and it was like hopping around. It had broken wings or something like that, and ended up dying because uh, Lisa's dog, the yellow one, remember it? Bodie. Oh, Bodie. Bodie. Yeah. Bodie. 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 Oh, Bodie. Yeah. Bodie. Yeah. He ended up killing it, and I felt bad, and I was holding it, and I walked back, and I showed mom and them, and they're like, "He's dead. You know, go throw it in the field. He's not going to come back to life." So I went in the field, and I felt really bad about it. So I put it in my pocket, like as deep as I could <laughs> in my pocket, thinking that I could somehow revive this bird later. later. <laughs> and I walk back, and I start eating and stuff, and they're like, "Logan, so where's the bird?" No, you walked in, and your face was like guilty, and there's this bulge coming out of yeah. like the side of you. And mom's like, "Logan, what do you it, have in your pocket?" No, no, no. She said, "Logan, where's the bird?" And I just. You just like looked down my and pocket. It was and a seagull, away. by the way. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. What was just like a little? What kind of bird was it? I don't know. I think I want to say a robin. Sparrow. A little sparrow. Sparrow bird. Yeah. So we used gross. to refer to him as Birdman for that a was long on the, time. Isn't that a rapper, the Birdman? Yep. No, and then yeah, I like I liked watching the Birdman cartoon a lot too. <laughs> so is that your only nickname Birdman? you have? Is the Birdman? I guess yeah. Floppy ears. <laughs> yeah. I used to call you man boobs. Sorry. No, you, you did it. Yeah, when he was maybe not to your face. You're mean. Oh. I remember, <laughs> I remember like trying to be cool in front of my friends. I'm like, yeah, he could borrow my sports bra. Logan's chubby because I was a bride. I do remember you saying that. You were mean. <laughs> we should put a Dude. picture right here of what Logan looked like when he was like six before years and old. afters. Yes. I remember right one time coming home from like a 4th of July party or something, my friends were all dropping me off and there was something like lit on fire on my porch and Logan had tied a bunch of tampons to a <laughs> hanger and lit them on fire and there was like these cute boys in the car and Logan was like, happy 4th of July! And I'm the only girl in the house and I was like... <laughs> nice one, bro. So embarrassed. Yeah, you did that. You went there. I kind of remember that, but I don't... <laughs> I didn't know what they were. Poor Logan, so. I was so mean. Do you remember all the you, things I made No, you that's the, all the memories I have of all the mean <laughs> things that you... Tell the story when you waxed the side of my head. Tell that story. Me and Holly wanted to know if this wax strip worked. We were like, Logan, come in the bathroom. So we put like this wax strip on the side of his side burn. It was burn, big, too. And we ripped it off, and burn? it waxed up and the side of his head. And it waxed the side of my head. head, yeah. And it was bleeding. It was bleeding. And Dad was working on the bathroom downstairs, so he had turned the water off, so we didn't know what to do, so we stuck his head in the in the toilet. toilet. <laughs> no. 
So I got a swirly and a wax job. Same Dude, day. they really screwed you over, didn't yeah, they? Yeah, there's countless stories like dude, that. that is, Logan just wanted yeah, to be my friend. tells us a lot, dude. All right. So he just went along with it. Or I made him dress up all the time. Remember when I wanted you to have, I wanted Logan to be paralyzed? Yeah, she used to, she so wanted I, me to be paralyzed. <laughs> I wanted so to she would, wow, she would so strap, strap me strap down to head. a wagon and a no, board. No, no, no. I strapped him to a skateboard that had no wheel. So I would strap his head to the skateboard and tie his paralyzed hands. for a little <laughs> yeah. while. And I would, well, here's what I'm here's what I I'm would picturing. You have no use of your him. arms or your legs. <laughs> and we strap you to a board. And I'll just take care of you. Do you, yeah. you want to play? It made me feel good. I wanted to take care of him. You're such a nurturer. So I would like flip, prop him up on a wall and like feed him food. <laughs> yeah. And I'd be like, okay, it's time to rest. And then I would leave there. Or remember when Where I made you I skateboard down the hill? I thought I wasn't yeah. around for any See, of You guys they, were gone. Yeah, See, it's like two sections. Like me and Casey have all those kind of stories of growing up together as like, you know, beating each other up and stuff. Like the scars from me. But and then they have their See, own little I took stories. Care of Logan. They have like their little set of stories. <laughs> what about the time uh, you guys always tell a story about when he, he, what he peed in his own mouth? Oh, yeah! <laughs> no! We're not <laughs> telling this that. story. So one time Logan really made me mad, and he, you were I naked was, for some reason. I was reason. young. I was like, <laughs> yeah, wait, wait, hold on. Let's, like let's, let's preface this story just a little bit. You were how old? Like he four or five. You were younger than that. It was I might have been little. This was, this was last week. And I held Logan. Somehow, you, I don't, we were wrestling. No, you, you used to do that to me all the time. You used to um, like tickle me, and then like you put my hands, my feet over my head. Oh, yeah, I'd put his knees on the floor, and, and he I was started laughing. laughing so, so hard. hard. He started, he started peeing. peeing. <laughs> and he was just it was like, peeing all over his face. In my mouth. I was just like, ew! <laughs> you peed in your own mouth. I was like three. Yeah. I oh, no. Probably <laughs> like, didn't even I was two. like, it was like the second week of I my life. I had my braces You know, so still. what was I to I do? had my I braces was, Yeah. I mean, I was like this, you <laughs> know? I was like this, peeing everywhere, and I had hip dysplasia. Uh, it was bad. <laughs> I was so mean to you. No wonder why you're so normal. It was a or I remember time. I would make Logan dress up for music videos. Oh, Valentine's <laughs> yeah, Day. Yeah, dude, I do remember that. I made that. Logan put on this Cupid play for Mom and Dad, and I put him in like, um, these pink blue. diapers. That song. Uh -huh. And we made like ramen noodles downstairs and oh, like, that candles. One. And, and you did you did made you serve Mom and Dad. Too. You made mushrooms. Those little sauteed mushrooms yeah, for I them. Yeah, made mushrooms. So here's my question <laughs> for you then. So you're probably pretty like protective of Logan, like the girls he dates. Yeah, I'm not in approval of anybody you Yeah, it's so far. impossible to find a girl that her and mom approve of. Oh, are you kidding me? Yeah, it's you, have, you have a mom. They don't exist. Double trouble. No, literally. It's <laughs> yeah. seriously so hard. Well, if you would date somebody normal. I let you guys choose half of them. No. You're 17. Just don't. Just don't Almost lie. 18. Almost oh, 18. Less Checking that year. ladies on YouTube. <laughs> Links below. Maybe we're gonna start a new Bachelor series and I'm gonna be in charge of it and Which we're gonna you line you up some women. I'd, I'd be down. <laughs> I'd be down for the whole teenager. internet dating scene. <laughs> oh gosh. All right, everybody. Thanks for stopping by for Crazy Butler Stories. We will see you next time. Leave your comments below. Check out Logan McKay55. Check out the new Bieber video. It's pretty cool. You guys don't need this guy. Cool. Ain't hushing with Lavier. Love you guys. <laughs> Thanks for stopping by. See you, everybody. See Later. you later. Thanks for joining us today.